Holy. Oh my god, he's got it. Oh! <laughs> he choked it too, bro. I might have to recommend you guys grabbing an old banana, bringing it out on the lake with you, and catching some fish because it seemed to work. And we've been out here for probably five, ten minutes. Yeah. And I've already caught three on that. Oh my god. It's a giant, bro. It is a freaking toad. What's going on everybody? Welcome to another video. If you guys haven't already, be sure to click that subscribe button. Also hit the notification bell right next to it. Also pepper the like button up. If you guys are enjoying the videos, I upload three bangers every single week. Be sure to click that subscribe button. Got my buddy Delton with me today. We're about to do some pond fishing and hopefully catch some big fish, but we got a little trick to add on to the video today. Let me show you. All right, so there's a whole myth behind, you know, if you bring a banana on the boat, that you just won't catch fish, it gives you bad luck, and, and you just won't catch any fish. You know, that's what everybody says. I've actually done it before. I did this type of video around five years ago. We're gonna be testing out a little bit different today. We're gonna be bringing a banana while we're bank fishing. So I'm gonna just keep it right in my pocket, and we're gonna see if it gives me some bad luck. All right, so we're gonna see, and this is gonna be a complete raw video. If we don't catch any fish today, guys, then we're just not gonna catch any fish today, but and we I'm could. On him. Exactly. <laughs> see, see, we or we could catch a 25 pound bag. So guys, this could go a bunch of different ways. But we're gonna be testing out the theory. If you bring a banana while fishing, does it give you bad luck? So let's go ahead and get it started. What kind of baits do you have on? That's the first thing. A simple old white chartreuse chatterbait. All right. My Concept Z, and I got a standard Texas rig black and red speed crawl and All right. bait black. Well, that's good. So you got a reaction bait and you got a slow moving bait. That's killer. Yeah. And then for me, I actually got a rattle trap right here, which should be really good. And then I have a fish head dude, which is one of those little scrounger looking baits. But as you guys can tell, you know, we got some clouds outside today. These fish should be roaming. I don't know if they're really active or not. I'm just hoping it's going to be good. And I'm hoping the banana gives us some good luck and not bad luck. So let's go ahead and get this started. Well, let's see. I got the camera in my pocket, the phone in my pocket, a full on bad luck, supposedly bad luck banana. Oh man, I just got whacked, bro. I mean, whacked. Holy, oh my God, he's got it. Oh, <laughs> he choked it too, bro. Oh, look at that guys. I mean, absolutely in the back of his throat. We just got out here, the banana fish. <laughs> right in the back of his freaking throat that is insane dude that was like my fifth cast so guys look at how far that fish choked it that is insane all the way in the back of his throat on the fish head dude that is insane that's like the fifth cast today he slammed me at first and just never got it and then all of a sudden he whacked me right when i started to bring it up on the bank and he started to pin it and that is the first fish of the day nothing huge but it's still look at his belly he's just yeah. chunky man he is a chunky fish i'll take him for the first fish of the day and the banana fish is still in my pocket but I don't know what to say, guys. It might be a good day. First fish, let's get a release on them. All right, beautiful first fish. Let's get back out there, see if we can catch some more banana fish. Uh-oh, oh, oh. oh. <laughs> yeah, bro, let's go. All right, baby. That's the first fish today. Quit on the old fish head dude. I mean, that, that happened so quick, guys. That, that is pretty surprising honestly i already see a fish hitting on the water out there it's a good cloudy day these fish are roaming chewing some bait man i hope we catch some more like that oh you got him oh my god he come off yeah, he came off. keep working it maybe he'll come out and eat it something going on right here on the bank a minute ago oh yeah i just called that too Golly, man. I just saw, I just said that too. I said I saw something going on in the bank. The banana has caught two fish. The non banana has caught none. <laughs> <laughs> Dylan's had one bite, and this is happening quick, man. I think we're going to have a good day. And that is just a stubby fish right there. I mean, not, nothing big, but look how fat and healthy he is. That. That's just a good fish, man. Let's get him back in the water. Two fish already, guys. And let's see if Delton can get one on that chatter bait. I'm curious about that because this dude is more of a, you know, softer approach. That chatter bait's more aggressive. You know, it's got that blade is wobbling. This is more of a finesse approach with a moving bait. So I'm kind of curious on how that's going to turn out today. And maybe they just want that more finesse approach. But let's keep going around and see if we can catch some more. All right, guys. Second little old banana bass. Hit that like button, baby. I'm, I'm so curious about, cause you have yours. See, see how mine has this little plastic and it's more subtle? 
So yours has got that metal. I'm kind of curious to see, you know, if they'll, this might have more bites because it's more subtle, you know? Yeah. Oh, I got another one, bro. I'm not kidding. It's a big one too. He feels gigantic, bro. Ah, oh, dude, he's just fighting super hard. But that is, are you kidding me, man? <laughs> Look at that. That just fell right out, dude, just like that. That is the third fish. Just about what? Two more casts? Three more casts? Maybe. Dude, the banana. I don't know, guys. I might have to recommend you guys grabbing an old banana, bringing it out on the lake with you, and catching some fish because it seemed to work. And we've been out here for probably five, ten minutes. Yeah. And I've already caught three on that. It might be the bait. It might be the bait, or it might be the banana. I don't know. Only one way to find out. So either take a banana with you, or throw the fish head dude. I mean, there's only two other ways. Man, third fish already. That's a long one. He's not as fat as the other ones. We're gonna continue and try to catch some more. Let's get him back in the water. All right, buddy. Thank you for biting, man. Banana is just making it happen, man. I don't know. <laughs> this is crazy, bro. <laughs> it's crazy, bro. Crazy. What to really prove this is you fishing in front of me and throwing like casts before me and just seeing if they want this softer approach or it's just the banana, man. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, I threw that behind you. There's no way. There is no way. I, I am, I am just cannot believe it. <laughs> Dude, what is going on, bro? I'm literally fishing behind you. Dude, this is crazy. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm trying to let like. I don't know, oh man. I don't know what to expect. Like, this is just unbelievable, guys. I already had four fish in like literally 10, 15 minutes. Dude, this is unbelievable. Fourth fish already, bro. And this is in the matter of- On the banana. On, on the freak, on the banana. All right, guys, we might've, we might've just found the secret. Secret Secret to bass fishing right here. Yep. Bring a banana on the water and you catch a lot of fish. Oh, you got a big one? Holy crap. Dude, that is a good one, man. See, bro, dude, that is a good fish right there. So, oh man, that is a fountain. Pounds. That's the best one today. Yeah. Oh yeah, good job. Got a fat little belt. On the chatterbait. All right, so we're getting somewhere now. That's good. By the way, if you guys want to check out the merch, look how sexy that is, man. That it's is so a, clean. That man. is some clean stuff right there. Be sure to check the links below. But look at that. He's got him a sweet bass, about two pounds on the chatterbait. Dude, good job. Good job. Let's get a release on it though. Oh yeah, man. Oh, dude, he took off, didn't he? Right back to that tree. Heck yeah, bro. That's five fish already. Yeah. All right, let's see what we can do with this other pond. Oh, it's got to have something right here ready to bite. I'm waiting on it. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God. He's, he whacked the back of it. <laughs> Barely hooked. Barely hooked. Don't got him another one. It's not big, but I mean. That's something, bro. Yeah. That's something for sure. It's the second fish on the chatterbait. Yeah. I'm still beating them by those with that little little guy. I don't know. It's probably the banana, man. It's got to be the banana. It's the banana. It's the banana. Still strapped and loaded. Still got the banana on me. <laughs> I still haven't got any bites ever since. I don't know. Yeah. Good job, man. Thank you. Big. Golly, man. Maybe it just kickstarted back on. I don't know. Let me see. Oh, dude. No, no, he wasn't coming out. <laughs> You thought you had a giant for a minute, didn't yeah, you? Yeah, I did. That's still a beautiful little fish. I think there's a little grass patch out there I was pulling them through. Really? There you go. Good job, man. All right. Good job. We're getting on board now. <laughs> now we just need Alan Bob on board. Wait. Come on, Alan. Let's get it, man. You need to be on board now. All right, guys. I got Alan Bob with me. This is first day What's freaking going on, back. Guys? All right. Back. So we're about to be filming. We're about to be doing stuff. But listen, I was telling Alan Bob about the old banana. That banana's aged <laughs> since we've been. You yeah. notice that? That oh. thing's got a little nasty, man. I think There's I gotta do it. Guys, listen, Jeez. you know, the, the bad luck banana, I think it's really starting to kick in, so I think I gotta get rid of it now, I'm not gonna lie. I think I gotta eat it, I'm kinda getting a little hungry. You gotta eat it, bro. I, I gotta eat the banana, man. I gotta eat the banana, yeah, and then it. we're gonna continue to go fish. Watch, I'm gonna eat the banana, man. And then guess what? We're gonna catch some fish, all right? It's gonna show that the banana might have a little bit of bad, I don't know, man. Come on, Delton. I mean, we came out here, dude, and I was whacking them. Whacking five and fish, all, all and of like, sudden, like. I don't know, we gotta change some up. I'm gonna eat the banana. We're gonna keep on fishing and we're gonna see if it changes our luck, guys. <laughs> I don't want you to fill <laughs> She got one? Uh-oh. I think you should have been throwing the trap, Alan. <laughs> that one's a little better, ain't it? Gosh man. They might be one in the trap. They're kinda of done with the chatterbait maybe. 
Golly, that's a good one, ain't it? I got him, man. Let me see. I thought he was bigger than that for a I minute. Too. That was a. Uh, get him back in the water. All right, Delton, show me what you got, man. A little pretty bass. Chatterbait? Chatterbait. Chatterbait. Yep. All this wind pushing back in this cove. It's looking good. That's right where you got him. And a little decent bass on the chatterbait. I thought he's bigger than that. I did too. He fought, I'll take him, man. Hard. I don't know. Banana's killing me now. At the beginning, it was good, bro. And now it's like bad luck. Yep. Straight bad luck. Uh oh. Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me, man? It's been so long since I've had a bite. Like he destroyed it. Did he really? Literally the the bill and everything on here. God, man, he destroyed me. I mean, he took my bill right off. I had to push it back on. And the swim bait. All right, man, I gotta try the trap. Maybe it's a trap type of day and this wind picked up. Huh? Oh my God. It's a giant, bro. It is a freaking toad. Grab the camera. Where is it? Bro, I mean, it's a giant. It's in my other pocket. It's in one of my pockets. Actually, it's not that big. <laughs> <laughs> Grab him. <laughs> you got him? <laughs> God, dude, I fell right off my butt. It's a solid two pounder. <laughs> dude, right when you said, dude, I got slammed, I was like, oh my God. All right, guys, I got another one finally, and this one's on the rattle trap. I just switched over to that golden booyah trap, gold with the black back, and caught him. Man, I thought he was, dude, I thought he was big. I fell on my butt, and I was just keeping the pressure. And I looked at him, he's like, dude, I just got slammed, and that was right when he just grabbed me. A pretty little fish, about two pounds, not bad at all. It's my best one today. Let's get him back in the water. All right, guys, there's that beautiful bass. Maybe they're wanting that trap better than that little dude. I don't know, at the beginning they're smoking that dude and might have to try that trap. See what they can do. Look at him looking at me. He's about to take off. There he goes. God, that was crazy. All right guys, so this is the trap that I'm throwing. It's just a standard gold booyah with a black bag. It's a one knocker. These are like the best trap. I love these little booyah ones. They're not too expensive and they're really similar to the old X calibers that they used to make. And uh, that's just what I'm throwing out here. I'm ripping it off the bottom. I've only caught one on this today. The rest I caught on that dude. But I'm just throwing it out there, letting it sink to the bottom and just ripping it up. And that's exactly how I just caught that last one. We're gonna continue for a little bit longer. See if we can catch some more fish. And uh, I don't know, man. I don't know about this banana thing, but so far it's been pretty good. Oh my God. Yeah, that's a good one, bro. Oh yeah, that's a good one. Oh, he's not big as I thought, but he's not bad. Look at that on that little gold trap with the black back. I thought he was a lot bigger, but man, still a beautiful bass. Guys, I don't know about this banana thing, man. Once I eat the banana, I'm catching bites again. I don't know. It could be bad luck. It could be good luck. I don't know, but that's another fish today. We're killing them pretty good, and that was on the trap. My second fish on that. I'm excited to see if we can catch a monster on this. I thought this was a good one. It sure did feel like one when he bit, but man, we're gonna continue just a little bit longer and hopefully catch a giant, man. I just got home, everybody, and I think that is going to conclude this video. But if you guys have any suggestions at all, or if you haven't even subscribed yet, be sure to hit that subscribe button and also turn the notification bell on. If you guys haven't already, be sure to pepper that like button up on this video if you guys want to see some more content like this. But also, leave a comment below on what type of fishing content you would like to see next on the channel. I would really like to hear you guys' feedback on what you guys like. Like, rather, if you guys like the tip videos better or the basic fishing videos, I really want to know, you know, what you guys like to see, and that's exactly what I'm going to make for you guys. But overall, thank you guys for all the support on every single video. If you guys haven't checked out the last episode, be sure to go check it out because there's a lot of big fish in that one. But thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys so much, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Beat it up, beat it up. Keep it up, keep it up. They gon' try it, they can't stop you. Eat it up, eat it up.
Eat it up. Yeah.